I've cheated death many times. Got right up close to it. It was never something I welcomed, but with it comes serenity. A clarity that you'd never expect. You experience the present as the inevitable destination of every step you've taken towards it. And in that same moment, you see a different path stretch out in front of you. The path you could have taken at the first step. We are all on this road together. The good men who fight for wrong causes. And the corrupt men who cloak themselves in righteousness. Each one of them convinced they are on the side of the angels. But every journey has an end. And death can only be cheated for so long. We had thrown everything we had at Atlas and come up short. Now it was time to pay the price. It, am I going to be paying the price? I don't like the sound of that. Captured. Unknown location. January 8th, 2061. Well, you know what? At least not that much time has passed by. Stay alert. Any detail can make the difference. What is this place? It used to be a research lab. Looks like Iron's modified it since. Research for what? Medical advancements, something like that. Doesn't matter. It's a prison now. This is it. Only way we survive this is by keeping our heads. Wait for an opportunity. Everyone off the truck now. Oh, I don't have an exosuit. Get him off the truck. I feel so weak and unempowered. That's all of them. Ten coming open. These two, these ten. Get them going. Into the cage. The rest of them behind the red line. And filling up. Wait, wasn't Gideon or Cormac sent on a completely different mission or from a different way? Wow. How'd you end up here? My air support was wiped out when Manico hit. I was outside the blast radius, but our squad was surrounded and outgunned. Is there a rescue force coming for us? Downtown is contaminated. We've pulled out the city entirely. I don't think anybody's coming. Well, that just means we have to make our own way. We can do that. Right, oh shit! Go, guys, out of the pen, out of the pen now. Okay, I thought they were gonna separate us from Gideon. Then we would have been really fucked. Here. What? Now. Yeah. Hi. Get over here. Let's go. Okay. I don't know why they had to drag me out. I was obviously about to follow them. God. Stop. Now. Okay. Jeez, they literally pushed me for turning around. <laughs> Oh god, are they killing people in the trenches? Ow! Sorry, I got stuck on the wall as I was looking in a completely different way. God! What the fuck is this? This is inhumane as shit! Okay, Irons has some serious problems. Now I can actually be like, uh, ow. Now I can disagree with what he's done. Jeez. That's far enough. Get him on the floor. Okay, all right. Look, I would willingly do this. Open. Wires out. Clear. Look him up. Go. The fuck? Have a nice day. Ah! Get away from me. What do you just do? Please don't do that to me. Okay. Well, that's the most humane thing they've done for us this entire time, I guess. There's gotta be a catch. Yep. All right. I wanted to meet the man whose mission it was to kill me. 
Our mission was to stop you. But if that meant killing you, I don't think anybody'd be too troubled. Failure is not something we tolerate here at Atlas, so I'm disturbed that three of my best contractors have failed so miserably. But that's the way it has to be. The wheat from the chaff, the strong from the weak. The ancient Spartans knew the true meaning of warfare. That truth has been lost to us for two millennia. What of your son, Will? What was he? Wheat or chaff? Will was the victim of the misguided policies of the United States government. Will died fighting for what he believed in. Of course, the tragedy is dying for what you believe in doesn't make it true. Oh! No. <laughs> You're not young, but you are strong, Cormac. So I give you 20 minutes to bleed out. Time enough to consider whether it was all worth it. Hey! And you. The prodigal son returns. I believed in you. I gave you a second chance. You're right, I'm alive. So at least there's that for me. Oh, well. They got their chance. Good for us. I've got him. Right, follow me. Stay quiet. Okay. My arm's kind of... broken. But I have the other one, so that's a plus. What the... fuck? They vacuum sealed the dead! Well, I mean, I guess that's... Better than leaving them outside a rot, but God. Hold on, I'm coming. Ooh. You look like his size. Grab his exosuit and side arm. Oh, <laughs> I can take his suit. I just figured that, you know, it was something that had to be applied by a mechanical system. Here. With only one wing, you won't be reloading. So make every shot count, and pick up new kit when you're empty. Ready. Oh gosh. Really? Grab a guy's gun when I'm out of ammo? This looks like Fantastic. Ilona, this way. Mitchell, get on that console and get the door open. Alright. Hurry up! You use your gun and kill all the other people. Uh oh! Drop your weapon! Get down on the floor! You will open fire! Mitchell, Get stay down. there! Drop it! Okay, I got him! What's happening? Ah, oh, shit. Door's locked. Stand back. Damn! Trying to get topside. We'll find another way. Okay, well. Mitchell, let's move. At least we don't have to cover four people at the same time. Just me. And Gideon. Oh, 
Oh, lucky me! SM6s with extended rounds. Or mags. If I know Alona, she'll secure topside Eva. Let's not keep her waiting. Yeah, no, I, I gotta move on, don't worry. Hey! Uh-huh. I don't want to kill any innocents. Manticore strikes. He's launching missiles. Baghdad was just the beginning. Washington, New York, Los Angeles. What the fuck? Military targets all over the country. Launches in less than two hours. Fuck me. How many people does he want dead? Uh, Jesus Christ. Uh oh. Well, at least I got another gun. Was he just talking about us? I've got him in my sights! Hey, how you doing? Stay calm. Shut up. What's going on here? Organ harvest? They're harvesting organs, the fuck? Elona. Elona, do you read me? Shit. Come on. Ugh. Why did irons have to be batshit insane? I'm fine with the taking over the infrastructure of the world thing, but just doors locked. Uh oh. See if you can sequencing. What? Cleared. Oh. So this is Ion's vision for the future. He's insane. Yes, he is. If we let him get away with this. And maybe I am slightly too. <laughs> Alright, let's stop messing with the dead bodies. Come on, Gideon. Out of the way! Move! Fucking burst fire weapon! Just what I didn't need in my life right now! Oh boy. Oh! I get a knife! I need a gun! Okay, we're gonna grab it from here. Check your ammo! Check my ammo. I can't check my ammo, I have none! I completely ran out of it. This is definitely different though. Alright, do I have anything on my gun? Oh, I have overdrive. Well, yes, this would be incredibly helpful. Oh, Jesus! Is he dead yet? No. Well, let's see if I can charge a knife a dude. Yeah! <laughs> oh, I take his gun instantaneously if I melee them like that. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. All right. We've got to keep moving. On the oh, fucking ground. Take it easy. Let's. Ah, yeah, take it easy. Oh Maybe we should ask one of these guys what's going on. Hey, don't you fucking move. Get back or I'll shoot. Come on, get the door. Get back or I'll shoot. He says to the guys with guns. Yeah, look where this is getting you. Where is Manticore launching from? Where? The, the Atlas Command Center. In the city! Oh! Let's go. Of course the bullets are coming through now! The hell are we? Uh... Organ dump? That doesn't sound good. Oh. Incinerator! Incinerator! Not good! We need a way out! Oh, you mean backwards isn't an option? Great! Wait, under this car! Mitchell, help me! You got it! We've gotta move this car! Come on! Push! You know, it's a damn good thing I've got a fucking XO on. Through here! 
Okay. I'm getting hurt a good bunch by this. You gotta pull me out. Oh! Gotcha. I was close. Oh, we're fine. I still have a gun. Sunlight. We're almost out. What if it's artificial sunlight? About the Manticore launch. Gideon, it's Alona. I've secured a vehicle for Exville. RV at the north wall. Yeah, there's our Alona. We're on route. Oh, serious? Through here. That's what he gets for fucking setting off the alarm. Stab it! Oh my god, you take so long to throw away your fucking gun, buddy. I was just gonna I'm shoot him, and then I'm gonna stab him, and we get stuff. Oh, come on! RV at the north wall. Good work. We're on route. Hurry! We're back to the north wall. Let's all run! Thanks for the save. Check your ammo. I am totally fine on ammo. Cause I just swapped the weapon. Flash out. You got a flash grenade? Oh shit. We got these assholes. The dicks who can take way too much fucking damage. And I can't even effectively continuously shoot them. I'm gonna smack him. Yep, that didn't work. Yep, okay. I tried to smack him with the gun, so that way he would be stunned, and it didn't work. I'm coming to knife you, bitch! Yeah! Shit. There we go, that's one way to get a gun. Need a better gun, like say the AMR9. He's dead? He is dead, good. Holy fucking tits. Oh, I'm alive. Oh, I'm very barely alive. Gideon, kill everybody else for me, man. I'm a handicap. Fighting a war. I'm totally capable because I'm awesome. Uh, Manticore launching things? There's enough Manticore here to hit every major military base in the world. So we, we should blow it up. And Let's move. Maybe we can rewire it to only affect the people who have been inoculated. Then it would only affect the people in this base. Yeah? Alright! I didn't help at all in that. Any station, it's a sentinel 2 1 in the blind. Do you copy? 2 1, this is Kingpin. We can see all. Now we lost your soldier. Irons is planning a biological strike against major bases in the next two hours. Understood. We are tracking your position. Sending air assets to assist the next Kingpin, do you copy? Ah! Hold on! We, went. we did not last all that long. On your feet. Watch it. Oh shit. It's <gasps> functional. Hit the manual punch out. Why have I never done this before? Oh, it's about fucking time. 
detected. Initiating zero connection. Zero passing yard. Left arm. Three passing. Flash through that wall. I'll hang back. You push forward and clear the way out. Okay, let's learn our way through this giant mech. Oh yeah! How's it going, motherfuckers? It's Gatling Gun time! <laughs> oh, I had to fucking okay. I had to reload. It's so silly. I didn't even know that was a problem. Rocket ready. Yeah, we'll shoot all those guys. Swarm ready. There are so many of them just all hidden up in the buildings. Jesus. Swarm ready. Rocket ready. It's a damn good thing I have the ability to take out a whole bunch of them at once. I think I just killed a civilian, but who cares? Get in! Yeah, he is behind me. Good. Just making sure you're following through. Yeah. I like how that just instantly locks on, is ready to fire. Uh, yeah, we'll just shoot that way. Those two people are especially gone. Oh, there was a guy hiding behind here. Good! Oh, shit. I'll show you who's better at piloting the ASCs you've been trained for, motherfuckers. Let's do this. Yeah, pow! Probably a very bad idea to try a melee punch a dude who's in another mech like me. Or a suit. But whatever. Well, that was accidental. He was collateral damage. Aww. This is probably going to break my suit. Oh, man. Okay, I'll just chill out in the passenger seat. Let's pray we're not too late. It is that it? <laughs> it's so it that brings you out of the experience so hardcore for there to just be like after action report, you finish the mission. Ah, uh, okay. With Gideon and Lona's help, you've escaped the prison camp and are speeding back to New Baghdad to stop the Manticore launch. And you lost a really badass AST along the way. Every piece of technology that we get to use just dies. And it's a saddening experience. Ah well. Okay, so... What could I go for? How about... Flinch. Yeah. That way I can be more accurate as I shoot people. And they shoot me back, rather.
Corruption is here.